hello everyone i'm trying to balance my camera hopefully it'll stay welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a pack with me i have all my stuff ready i'm practically traveling across the country flying out later this afternoon i'm going back to california which is where my college house is with all of my roommates i'll be doing school online but i still wanted to head back there for the fall semester this is the suitcase that i'm going to be bringing this is gonna be like my toiletry bag it's gonna be a carry-on i'm definitely gonna need that because i probably have a lot more stuff than i think i'll probably bring that bag as well and then just a purse so first thing i need to do is basically pull everything out of my drawers i have pretty much everything kind of like organized like tops bottoms in here then i have like workout stuff stuff that i'm probably just gonna leave here for when i come back for christmas and then yeah swimsuits all that good stuff I'm gonna lay out everything right here and kind of organize it by style and color just so it's easier for me when I unpack when I go back to school. I actually really really enjoy packing for some reason. It's just like soothing for me and relaxing for me to kind of put everything together and organize it and try to fit in into a little suitcase. have a lot more stuff than I was expecting this is just tops and next I'm gonna do bottoms so I'm gonna take all of my stuff from these next couple drawers for bottoms and I realized that most of this stuff like I probably won't be wearing in California since it's gonna be hot still so I'm gonna keep like some jeans and like three pairs of joggers so that should definitely save a lot of space just because joggers are obviously like thicker so the fact that I'm just bringing like my summer stuff back, it should save a lot of room in my suitcase. <laughs> my, <laughs> my sister just woke up, she came in, she looks so cute. Come here! <laughs> you look so cute. <laughs> you get to leave Hi. this little munchkin today. She's probably happy about it though, because I've been annoying her. No. <laughs> I'm doing good so far I'm just gonna like organize everything when I put it in my suitcase which you'll see and I decided like I said to leave this stuff but I need to do my workout things but I feel like these won't take up a lot of space space just because they're like smaller items they're just like spandex biker shorts and sports bras so luckily I don't have a whole lot of that and I just told my sister that she could borrow the clothes that I'm leaving here. She was like super excited. She was like, oh. I was like, oh, I'm leaving some clothes. And she's like, and I was like, oh, you can borrow them sometimes if you want, if you take good care of them. So she was pretty happy about that. I just laid out my workout shorts, sports bras, and then like bralette type stuff. So I think I'm gonna pack all of these things first before I determine what sweatshirts I'm gonna bring back. So far, these are the things that I'm leaving just cause they're more like wintry and I definitely won't wear them at school just cause our house gets so hot as well and the weather will stay warm. I find that it helps to lay out everything like on my bed before I put everything in here just so I can kind of like get an idea of how much I'll be putting in here and as you can see everything fits really nicely I still have some room like right here and then this is not quite like full so I can put stuff on top so I'm gonna go through my sweatshirts now and see and I also remembered I need to pick out an outfit outfit for the airport as well and another tip is to like wear your heaviest close so I'll probably wear like a big baggy sweatshirt and then like this jacket just so that this is not going in my suitcase so 
next I have swimsuits. I have them all in right here. And I have a lot just because it was summertime here. So I have a lot to bring back. For space, I'm doing pretty, pretty well, but I'm just worried about weight. I'm gonna put the swimsuits right in this area. And I have still a lot of room like up over here and like I could always put stuff on top of here. tip pack your bikinis tightly so that you can fit more like throughout your suitcase i'm gonna leave some home just because i really don't need that many and kind of ridiculous how many i actually had these are all the toiletries i'm being, bringing back nothing like too special i just have to squeeze them in both of these bags i might only need one actually and then i also have just some random stuff you know when you pack you just kind of like accumulate random things you're like oh i need to bring this i need to bring this so i have these boxes from my sunglasses i'm actually going to sell some of these on poshmark so i'm bringing the boxes back to school with me and i am going to put some jewelry in there just some random stuff that i have laying around in these boxes and then i'm going to like squeeze them in my suitcase just to kind of like save space and maximize it Are slowly starting to come together my suitcase is pretty much done for the most part I was super happy because we have one of these measuring things basically you just like lift up your suitcase and it'll measure the poundage on it oh gosh it's kind of heavy okay a big reveal do you guys think it's over 50? 50! 53! 3 pounds. It's 3 pounds over? Yeah, I feel like I could take this thing out. Oh shoot, 3 pounds. I had the red one and the offline bag, so I just have to squeeze some stuff in there. So, okay, I took out a couple sweatshirts to lower the poundage because it was like 40 or 53. Took out three pounds, then I was down to 48. Put a sweatshirt back in there and then now I'm gonna pack my carry-on. Oh, that was stressful and I'm sweating so bad but I'm glad that this part is done so that I can kind of like stop worrying about this because this is the only thing that really matters like poundage wise. And now just kind of gotta pack up the extra stuff and then I'm done. I'm a happy girl right now because I just found my other AirPod. I, I lost the left one. Couldn't find it for like four days. We went to the Apple store this past weekend. I was gonna get another one, but it didn't work out. And then I found it today, an hour before I'm supposed to leave. Like if that's not, good luck. I don't know what is. Happy I have that and this bag is done. I have, I ended up fitting this sweatshirt and this jacket in here, which is good. And then I'm actually just gonna wear this sweatshirt instead because I realized my outfit wouldn't really match the orange one so this stuff goes in this bag I have shoes in here my purse which is kind of a bummer that I have to have a purse inside a bag but that's the only way that I'll make it work and then my laptop so this is pretty light which is good I hate when this thing is heavy it's so hard to carry around the airport when it is and then I just have electronic stuff on this side books this random just honestly random stuff that I had in my room. And then I almost forgot my tripod because I had my camera standing on it. So 
This fits, this fits perfectly in there as well. So I can zip this thing up. I think that's all I'm gonna fit inside of it. I'm pretty sure all suitcases have this, but this one like expands. So originally it's supposed to be like that, but you can unzip this to make it bigger. So helpful tip if you're like looking for luggage. A couple more things I'd love to do. I just have to put my liquids that are going in my carry-on in a plastic bag. I'm bringing my water bottle and I almost forgot my speaker. Then I need to grab a phone and cord. I just did like a cleaning of my room. Not that it was like super dirty before, but now I have to say goodbye to it <laughs> until like December, which is crazy, which seems like so long away, but it's gonna come up so fast. I'm bringing a snack for the plane. <laughs> that I'm gonna carry on. One last touch, can't forget. <laughs> the hoops, these are my heaviest hoops. So I'm wearing them on the plane just cause <laughs> I'm saving room in my suitcase. Bringing this sweatshirt. I just wore this the other day, but it's so comfy. And I like to just wrap it around my waist for in case I get cold. And then I have to put my shoes on. They're still wet from them being washed last night, but it's gonna have to do. This will be my last time filming here, so my next video will be in my house in San Diego. But yeah, it's always bittersweet leaving, but it's good for change and I'm ready to like get back in the school mode, school grind. My dad brought my bags out, which was nice of him, but we're gonna head out right now.